The ASEAN Centre for Biodiversity is an intergovernmental regional centre of excellence that facilitates cooperation and coordination among the members of ASEAN, and with relevant national governments, regional and international organisations on the conservation and sustainable use of biological diversity, guided by fair and equitable sharing of benefits arising from the use of such biodiversity. Description Acknowledged as the first regional initiative to save the ASEAN's rich but highly threatened biodiversity, ACB is a continuation of the ASEAN Regional Center for Biodiversity Conservation which was a joint cooperation project of the ASEAN and European Union and hosted by the Department of Environment and Natural Resources of the Philippines. Topic. Funding the center From 1999 to 2004, ARCBC successfully established the bridge that fostered strong collaboration among ASEAN member states and between ASEAN and EU partner institutions, and gained recognition in the regional and global arena for biodiversity. A year later in 2005, the ASEAN and EU agreed to establish the ASEAN Center for Biodiversity to carry on the work of the completed ARCBC project. The financing agreement inked between EU and ASEAN provided the necessary funding for the establishment of ACB. The center was established primarily to facilitate coordination and cooperation among AMS on the sustainable use and conservation of biological diversity. The agreement on the establishment of the center was signed by the Environment Ministers of Brunei Darussalam, Cambodia, Indonesia, Lao PDR, Malaysia, Myanmar, the Philippines, Thailand, Singapore and Vietnam on behalf of their respective governments. Topic: <laughs> Government Relations. The National Biodiversity Center represents Singapore in the ASEAN Center for Biodiversity and is the national agency involved in biodiversity conservation and research in Singapore. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Launch. ACB was launched at the 9th informal ASEAN ministerial meeting on the 27th of September 2005. The agreement also established the ASEAN Biodiversity Fund with voluntary contributions of the AMS, other governments and organizations as approved by the governing board. The fund is to be utilized to meet the expenses of the center and its various initiatives. The President of the Philippines Her Excellency Gloria Macapagal Arroyo has recommended to the Senate President and members of the Senate the ratification of the Host Country Agreement HCA between the Government of the Republic of the Philippines and the ASEAN Center for Biodiversity. Signed on 8 August 2006 in Manila, the HCA provides that the Philippines shall be the host country for the ACB which is currently headquartered at the University of Philippines in Los Baños, Laguna. Subject to concurrence by the Senate, the Philippine government will later grant immunities and privileges to ACB and its staff. The Department of Environment and Natural Resources DENR, the Department of Finance DOF, the Bureau of Immigration BI, the Department of Transportation and Communication DOTC, Banco Central ng Pilipinas BSP, and the University of the Philippines Los Baños UPLB, have endorsed the ratification of the HCA. Topic. Focus and scope Dr. Ahmed Jogloff, Executive Secretary of the United Nations Convention on Biological Diversity CBD, calls ACB, "...a unique mechanism that uses the bottom-top approach to deal with the biodiversity loss problem." Now on its 41st year, the ASEAN has resolved to further strengthen its commitment to protect its biodiversity from degradation. As part of the ASEAN action to save the region's biodiversity, the countries declared 27 areas as ASEAN heritage parks and designated 1,523 protected areas based on the World Conservation Union category. 
Executive Director Rodrigo Fuentes said. He added that. Promoting national and regional cooperation to address measures related to environmental agreements, and establishing a regional database containing an inventory of the region's biological resources are also part of the action to curb biodiversity loss. Now on its third year, ACB reinforces its efforts to engage more sectors and stakeholders in the quest to save the region's biodiversity. It forms alliances with key stakeholders in the regional and global levels. Topic. External links ASEAN Center for Biodiversity official site. Retrieved 10 June 2013.